Welcome, everybody. This is Nightsaber Z42, and this is going to be the first episode of a new Let's Play called Torren. Torren is actually, uh, well, it's kind of a question that I've had on my mind for a long time, where I actually asked myself if any Hispanics actually made video games, and Torren is actually, was developed, or the publishers, or, wait, how should I say this? I think it was the developing team was actually based in Brazil. And so, this game is kind of intriguing to me in that respect. Also, it's about a female protagonist, so let's get on with it. New Journey. From my understanding, Torden is actually an adventure game. So, ooh, pretty visuals. Sure are a lot of ravens around here. And that guy's about to get eight. <gasps> That's us. I was like, we got some serious hair going on, just like a. Oh, Merida! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! It's like not even a minute inside, and I already killed myself. Okay, but in in, res in regards. Jumping was kind of weird. Okay. Getting some controls out of the way. Because, uh, once you go forward, you just kind of keep going forward. I have no control over my jumping after I actually jump. Okay, so. What do I got to do? Oh, here comes the shadow of doom, death. Here it comes again. I feel it. It doesn't seem to be hurting us, but I don't know. There's no HUD or anything. But we're gonna come up to this black dragon. I don't know how we're gonna kill him with the measly sword that we have. Come on, bruh. I'm gonna slash ya! Oh. Maybe not. That didn't work. Looks like we're gonna be dead too. But oh, don't step on the goop. Oh, we turned to stone. That's not cool. Is that Cthulhu? <gasps> we're really the Statue of Liberty. So the, apparently there's something important on that scroll there. It's golden. Well. I managed to kill myself twice in this playthrough already. How about that? There's a, an electrical ball of fire up there. Ooh. There's a transparent piece of cloth or something. Looks like linen. But it sounds like paper. You know, for some reason, this game kind of reminds me a little bit about Ico from the PS2 era. But I know this game probably has nothing to do with that game. It just kind of reminds me of that for some reason. Ooh, pretty sunlight. Oh, maybe Golem's going to come out of the hole. How awesome would that be? Ooh. Okay. A baby. And a sundial. And a whole bunch of blood. So we were born from nothing. Oh, hey, look at that. We instantly grew up. How about that? Oh, and I'm crawling on the floor. Okay. Quite literally the weirdest game I've ever played. Okay, so I can't even move back. I have to go forward. Is that a bird? What kind of bird is that? Oh no, the bird is flying. <gasps> oh, sweet. We're going to be a sword cutting baby. 
Haha, <laughs> major trip. Oh, she's got like a little medallion on her, around her neck, and okay, I guess just just gonna fall no matter what. So, oh, I have to hold. It'd be nice if I could read. You know, went to college and I never read anything. It was like a little magician guy. Oh, and we grew up again. Oh, we are grown up already, sort of, maybe. Look at Cthulhu right there. Maybe I'm supposed to go talk to him. Look at our hair. It's pretty balling right there. Oh. Okay. Let's go talk to the Cthulhu man. Yeah, just took out his face and beard. I mean, that's not gonna hurt at all. The scroll will show us how. Am I supposed to push something? Okay. <laughs> It's a pretty neat mask too. Well, there's a plant growing in his arm, in his hand. And now it's growing in our hand. Let's go plant it somewhere. Maybe in the center? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, so we were reincarnation. That makes sense. Can I make it grow? Probably shouldn't step on it. Let's go to the sun. The sun. Huh. So the moonlight has been trapped. Oh wow, we're like next door neighbors there. He's literally right there. So I got the weird jumping stuff again, but that's okay. So I wanna move around. What oh. Okay, sweet. So I am playing this on 360 controller by the way, so yes. And I can climb the ladder. So yeah, wow, are we really gonna tackle that dragon already? Sounds like a bad news bears kind of scenario. Oh man. That tower is pretty ballin' though. I'm liking it. I see red everywhere. Ooh, pink. Ooh, a stag. Hello. Ooh, I'm gonna ride you. Oh, I'm petting you, okay. You gonna follow me? Yeah, let's go on an adventure. Ooh, I want that sword. Oh, I can walk. I need a combination. Oh, sweet. Oh, I got a scroll. That is a flimsy looking piece of paper. There's something wrong with our body or something. The way we stand looks kind of weird. Okay. 
This contract of knowledge is written on our skin in blood, in darkness beneath the well. The tree of life will be revealed, hidden deep in its shadows, the truth awaits your light. You must defy time, Moonchild, sacrifice your childhood, and you can free us all. Huh. Interesting. So... We need to sacrifice ourselves? Or maybe we just need to grow up, I guess. How do we grow up? Man, there's a lot of blood over there too. It's kind of creepy. Okay, so let's go this way. We're gonna climb the tower. Ooh, a telescope. I wanna look at the telescope. Okay. The price to be paid in oh. The earth itself reveals the price to be paid in blood. Calling his truths a lie. Ancient ghosts litter his past. Ooh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Time mocks the night, impotent before evil. Oh no, it fell. And it broke. Oh well. It wasn't us. It was this statue lady right over there. What's over here? No, I'm probably not even supposed to go over here yet. Let me go inside first. Oh, don't fall, please. Yeah. There we go. Ah, you got blue hair now. Or I see blue hair. <laughs> Stairs up there. And a ledge over there. I guess we're taking the stairs. <laughs> so I guess we are a moon child and our goal is to defeat the dragon. But it's going to have to do something with time. Hey, this is where we were born. Oh, I need to move the time wheel. We need to become older. Oh no, we're uncovering the hole. Uh, it doesn't look like a good idea. Yeah, don't fall. Don't fall. Ooh, I don't know if I want to go inside that deep dark hole. Ooh, tree is. Coming to life. And there's a sword. Yeah, let's take the sword. Reach! Grab it! I don't know, that sword looks pretty heavy. Oh, wow, this tree's just growing and growing and growing like none other. Ooh. Be careful. Fire's gonna burn you. Huh. So we need to get the tree. Or we need to get the sword on the tree. And I think the sword went up. So we need to get back up. How do I get up? Obviously not there. So we're taking the stairs. Okay. Should I jump on that branch? Is there anything out that way? Doesn't look like it. And I quite frankly don't want to jump. <gasps> oh, but I can step on this tree branch. Yeah. Just don't fall, little girl. Don't fall. Don't fall. Don't fall. Okay. Just nonchalantly just walking on the branch there. That's pretty good. Oh, I have to go this way. Okay. Well, let's take to another ledge that we can climb. 
because the stairs are broken. If you couldn't tell. Okay. Oh God! No! No! Oh, why did I jump? I'm so stupid. Oh, that's it. Interesting. Okay, so let's climb the tree again. Sorry, you're gonna have to do your balancing act once again. Ooh, you know, bare feet on a tree bark. Doesn't seem very comfortable. Let's get some sandals. Okay, there you go. Just one step at a time. Don't let the wind blow you off. I can hear the creaking of the wood on the tree. Everything will be fine. Okay, we made it. Let's not jump this time. Kill ourselves. Are we at the sword yet? Is the sword up here? Yeah, it's right there. Ooh, we have to get somehow get to the other side. Can I go through here? Yeah. I'm like the world's greatest detective, guys. Hmm. What is that? It looks like an insect or something. Ooh, what is this? Well, these are other girls. What is that? See that? It's like a bug. I want to touch the bug. Oh, you're bad guys. Oh, I can toss you. Nope. Get away from me. I'm going to deal with you right now. Okay, so we came from there. And there's something um, going on with this. Let's roll it. Oh, there's a little, mm, there's a little statue thingy. Oh, and I'm gonna die. Yep, I died. That is probably true. Oh, every time I die, I have to be reborn at the altar of blood. Okay. Well, that totally makes sense. Well, I'm going to cut the episode off here. Hello, Stag. So feel free to leave a comment down below. Check the description for my Facebook and Twitter information. And while you're at it, go ahead and give this video a big thumb up to support the series. And subscribe to the channel if you want to see more. I will see you guys in the next video.